three three local Tibetans. Who knows how long they'll be walking for? They are clearly doing the pilgrimage to Lhasa. The Tibetan Kartao is a ritual in Tibetan Buddhism. Palms put together, which means realizing the instructions by the Buddha. Tibetans prostrate themselves on the ground with the head, arms and knees down on the ground. It is said that touching the forehead, the mouth and the breast embodies combining body, language and thought with the Buddha. They then move forward slowly following every third step with a kowtow. This is a way to express their most honest hearts to the Buddha. As they walk from their hometown to Lhasa, during the long journey they wear wooden protective pads to shield their hands and knees and fur to ward off dust on their faces. This girl behind me, she's probably no, no older than 12, 13. And here she is, she's probably been walking. No, honestly, I can only guess. But like from uh, the look on her face, the dirt, the marks in her head, and uh, just th her dirty clothes. I'm just assuming that she's been walking for a long, long time. A kowtow rule is strictly practiced by Tibetans. While doing the kowtow, they are supposed to patter the six-word sutra without stopping. <laughs> We complain, complain about our, our little sickness and this and that. These people, they put in the hard yards. They're dedicated in what they believe in. That they're, they're passionate about everything that they're doing. They do it with you know, conviction, with purpose, with, with grace, with poise, with everything. And it doesn't make me feel any better. I feel even worse because. I'm such a little sook. For me, it's truly unbelievable the compassion and perseverance among Buddhist followers. It puts most Western world to shame, including myself, as we constantly complain about trivial things. Watching this old woman, it makes me realize humility is the one thing we as a people need to learn more. Good, good.